Good morning. My name is Amaya Lachey Jackson, and my screencast is on Chapter 4, Paintings. The first painting I chose is of Mona Lisa, painted by the famous Leonardo da Vinci, created in 1503. The medium used for this painting is oil on wood panel. I like that this work of art because it gives off the conception of a simple portrait but it's filled with so much mystery. The famous Gonica smile and the eyes that seem to follow you doesn't just give off one emotion but many depending on how long you analyze it. The image of the mysterious woman became the standard pose for future portraits. Though the positioning looks unnatural, it portrayed a sense of poise and beauty. The second painting I chose is of The Creation of Adam, painted by the famous Michelangelo. Created in 1508, the medium used was fresco. The precision and detail of this painting is why I chose it. Although the medium chose dries fairly quickly, he was able to work through it and get this beautifully designed piece of art created. This painting still lies on the walls of the Sistine Chapel with the subject matter being Michelangelo's representation of how God created Adam in the book of Genesis. The third painting I chose is of the Flaming June, painted by Frederick Lord Layton. Created in 1895, the medium used is oil on panel. The pigment of this painting is what caught my attention. The hue of the subject's dress gives off a vibrant, eye-catching orange. The medium chose for this work of art gave the artist the ability to create perfection because of the long drying period. It also portrays the idea of a sleeping nymph. The last painting I chose is The Last Supper, painted also by Leonardo da Vinci, created in 1995. The medium used was oil and tempera on plaster. The famous painting caught my eye because I knew the meaning behind it. Da Vinci was not the only one to paint a mural representing the Last Supper from the Bible, but he was the first to successfully create it with realistic faces, which increased its value. Instead of using fresco, he experimented with a mixture of oil and tempera to create this gem. Although the painting chipped and needed restoration over time, it is still one of a kind. The subject matter being a depiction of the moment God told his disciples that one of them will portray him. And my last slide is of my sources. Thank you for watching.